that scared me and I can't believe that just happened. Oh my gosh, can we just... <sighs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are going to continue the 100 baby challenge and we're just gonna get right into it. Okay, so first things first is I do remember I said that I was going to change up their looks off camera. Obviously I did not do that yet. So some at some point I will do that for them. Um, I might just do it right now actually. So I'll go ahead and do that very quickly. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and get started. She needs to go to sleep. I think she got pregnant. Whoa, she has a lot going on. So much going on. I thought she got pregnant three right before the last one. Oh no, guys, this is really bad. I don't know how she's on her period. Oh gosh, well at least, okay, we have to wait two days. This puts a total wrench in our plans. We have to wait two days before she could get pregnant. I don't know what happened, guys, Come but up. I thought that she got pregnant during the last one. I, I'm gonna have to go back and watch the watch the last episode because I put a she got pregnant. Yeah, it's because he's still here. That's probably why she couldn't get pregnant then. Now that I'm thinking about it. That is probably why. Just a break. Okay. She's waking everyone up. Thank goodness they are school. Okay, you do that. You can go to the doctor there. I want you to fix all this stuff to repair that. No, we are here, but we get the handiness skill. So she's going to the bathroom. I'm gonna let her go back to sleep. She's getting cake, of course. You know, because there's nothing else in the fridge. Okay, she's good. I don't know. I think they will do their homework. She just needs a skill. Honestly, I think going and chatting with someone will probably be the easy easiest thing to do. Okay, so hopefully that will get her skill right on up. She's dazed because she got electrocuted, I guess. Let's see. Um, okay, so she did her homework and stuff. I think mainly we just need to work on her skills and stuff. Um I'm having her fix the fridge right now. I'm gonna let her go to the bathroom. And I'm probably might make her go on a little jog before school starts. Because I think we're gonna do the fitness skill for her since we did candy miss for Alex. Eric is very hungry. Well, Eric, that sounds like a personal problem, but I guess I can help you. Here. Eric. Oh no, you're not Eric. Mommy. And then he goes and goes to the trash. Like, he's so hungry, but he has time to go into the trash. We're gonna clean it up. Clean it up. Okay. That scared me, and I can't believe that just happened. Oh my gosh, can we just... <sighs> okay, we need to plead, 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 plead. She cannot die right now. That is not an option. Okay, you need to wake up and plead for your child. I am so upset right now. Oh my gosh. Should we should we seduce or should we plead? Hmm. I I say we just plead for right now. Hopefully we won't we'll regret it. Please, please do not. Please don't kill her. Oh. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Becca is saved. Becca is saved. Just go far. Okay. Becca, you are never touching another thing again. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That like literally, I I like my heart is beating so fast because I'm so scared. <gasps> okay, you can go back to sleep after that. <laughs> and you know, um, this goes cool. Never touch another electronic thing in your life. Now we have a baby crying. He needs a bath. Okay, you can't go to sleep and you can't shower. Okay, 
quickly do super efficient baby care, um, give him a nice bubble bath, and then you can shower and go to bed. You can go on the pod? Oh, you can't potty here by yourself yet. Okay. Just, just play it with some blocks. And now we have to go and just in our house watching TV. Cool. Okay. And she's just sitting here, you know, her daughter just died. She had to, like, plead for her child's death. And she's just sitting here eating some fish tacos. Okay, she went and showered, but she didn't take care- she- she take- she- blah, 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 blah. She took care of the- I don't even think she- I mean, she said she took care of the baby, but I guess because he's on his blocks, she didn't bother to give him a bath. So you're gonna get out of the shower, and you're gonna give your child a bath. And you're also going to potty train him. Delish! <laughs> oh, um, I think that's a job offer, so we're not gonna bother with that. Okay, so now Can let's Kobu go Koiba? potty, oh, Eric. Yeah. Oh, yes! Little Eric's pottying now. She's clearly tired and I'm assuming it has cramps, but you know, that's personal problems. I feel like toddlers just take forever to potty. Like, it should not take that long. Okay, I'm gonna let her go ahead and go to sleep. She's not feeling too great. And I'm gonna have these kids study hard in school, especially Becca. We just want to just hurry up and get her out so we don't have to worry about anyone dying again so what does little eric need okay so he has communication he has imagination he needs movement so let's just do stack a little bit and then he also needs potty and thinking okay which both of those things he basically needs someone else to help him get okay i don't know how we're gonna figure this out okay so hopefully echo will be home by the time he's finished his movement skill, and then we'll just make Becca. Well, it looks like you might have to take a little nap though, because it looks like he's getting tired. So that works out well. So Becca will have a little rest to be able to do her homework and whatnot, and or go to sleep more like it. Looks like she's exhausted, so I'm gonna let Becca take a little nap. Um, she is also very very exhausted. So take a nap. And she just needs some fun. So watch a little TV. And then you all are going to do all of your homework. Okay, I heard you and Jeffrey Landgram are good friends now. You're getting more popular. Clearly you're a good person to know. And then Becca has Alex would like to come over and hang out. Sure, Alex. You can come over. Oh my goodness. What is wrong with- did you pee yourself or something? I don't have, have a clue why you would be- how are you so dirty? Okay, take a shower and just go to sleep. Alex is here! And he's just standing in front of her saying something that smells. And now he's just staring at his little sister. Okay, so then I can wake up and take care of her. Okay, I think that's enough TV. You're, you should be fine now. I'm going to have her shower and then we need to take care of our garden. That's one thing. Um, just sell, no, sell all and it doesn't really look like we need to do anything else. Okay, we need to probably bring this inside at some point because it keeps on getting destroyed by the lightning. Anyways, and now she has- she's excited from being- from brush with the death. Okay. I wouldn't feel that way if that happened to me, but... Each their own. Why aren't you going to sleep? Go to sleep. Please. Okay. Okay, now she's on her period, so... Let's take care of that. And let her shower, and then go to sleep. Okay. After you're done eating, you need to go to the bathroom and then do your homework. Because you're the only one that's like, fine. Everyone else is just a hot mess. Oh! I didn't even realize. Um, Christine can A up. She has an A. There's just been so much chaos, like, I just didn't- I can't even keep up. Now, this one has woken up and he's hungry. I feel like no one's actually sleeping. Like, everyone is still so tired. Like, he literally was supposed to sleep. And this is his energy level. 
But whatever. I guess he had a nightmare until he woke up, but, like, still. And he wants to be put to bed, but whatever. Whatever! Okay. I think everyone has is basically supposed to be going to bed pretty soon. I feel like this episode has just been utter chaos and nothing has, like, gone... Um. Really nothing has happened, but Becca almost died. And now her dad's calling her. About trying for a baby? What? We've been thinking about trying for a baby lately. Do you think we should do it? We want to, but we're not sure. It's a huge responsibility. What do you think? Honestly, we should say you a parent because, you know, this is like one of the very few conversations you've had with your child. I, I think that's just what we're going to say. And then he says, what? You don't think I'd make a good parent? I'd be an amazing parent. You're going to, we're going to try for a baby right now. Take that, ha. Huh? Okay. Very mature there. That's very interesting. I've never had that before. Okay. I like every like little noise and sound. I'm just like, is someone dying? Can you ask Alex? Yes. Alex, teach your brother how to potty, please. That, that wasn't really much help, but okay, thanks. Now he's leaving. I have to go now. Try not to miss me too much. Well, at least he helped a little bit. You just go to sleep, please. I think everyone just everyone just needs to go to sleep. You are all so annoying. You need to sell this. And since I also was thinking, since I have the nifty knitting and everything, maybe that could be another way that she can make money is by selling knit stuff on Popsy. But, um... You know, honestly, at this rate, we might never do that because it's just, this household is a hot mess. Um, I don't think we have time for that. I think she's, yes, I was right, she is sleeping in the tub. Okay, we're gonna not do that. Um, and of all places, you decide to do your homework on your sister's bed. Great. Okay, at least you're finished. You go to sleep. Everyone just go to sleep. The only person that's not tired, of course, is Sav well, no, so she is tired. But she literally slept all day, so I don't understand why she would be tired. But whatever. I love how they like literally climb over each other. Okay, so we will just catch back up with everyone in the morning, and hopefully we'll have some calm. Okay, great. It looks like Christina's going through a phase. And then the first thing she does is go to play. Okay, we're not gonna do that. Go eat, and then you can watch some TV, and then you're gonna do your homework, because you haven't done that yet. And Savannah, I think you're the one that has the most energy out of you and Becca, so you're gonna calm down and take care of your baby. We still have like a few more hours before we can try for baby again. I'm gonna let her paint some more, because she's feeling okay. Okay, guys, I just realized I completely forgot. Christine can eat up, so we need to make a cake, I think, because I think they've been, yeah, they've been eating all of the other cakes. Oh no, they haven't. Okay, perfect. Okay, come and blow out your candles, little Christine. So now we have two teams in the house. Well, we will have, because she hasn't aged up just yet. I don't think anyone's going to be celebrating with her, but you know. Well, she might, maybe. Come here. She's going to miss it. She missed it. Too late. Okay, so little Christine has the new trait of bookworm and the aspiration of vampire family. Interesting. Oh. Okay, oh. we're gonna put some candles right up on there. Your mother completely missed your little birthday, but that is okay. And we're gonna put that right in the oh, fridge. Torque. And I'm actually going to have her cook some Kima? breakfast. Have some Organo. fruit and Chobaba yogurt or whatever. Fruit parfait, whatever. So Christine probably won't end up going to school today, but we can go ahead and have her do her homework and clean that up and sell this. Okay, so I think everyone has their homework done earlier, or is at least working on their homework. So hopefully, maybe potentially, little, uh, I keep on forgetting their names, Danielle 
will become a B student today. They'll have her study hard in class. And Becca is not going to become an A student because she still needs to get her skills together. School starting, so you all can go to school. And since she's not going to be going to school today, since she just ate it up, she can take care of this kid. Okay, get him some food. And then you're going to just do a bunch of work today, kiddo, with your older sister. Where's the food that she was supposed to make? She was supposed to make yogurt parfait. Or whatever it's called. And I don't see it. Okay, we'll make french toast then. And open? Or should we just sell it? We'll open it, we'll risk it. And of course the baby's fine. Take care of the baby. And then we should also- no, not self-publish. Potty train your brother. Okay. It says, why do you wear the same thing every day? Are you a cartoon character? Yeah, we are. Okay. Have a problem with that? Okay, so you try to train your brother while you're on your phone. Cool. Um, and then you're gonna teach him blocks. Shapes, whatever. And hopefully you actually successfully cook something this time, Savannah. Okay, yes. Oh, we're two level- we're two star celebrity? And we need to figure out a skill that we'll have you work on. You know what? She can be the cook of the house. How about that? We'll have her make everyone a grilled cheese. So he's playing with his blocks. Building up his skills. Okay, someone's calling Savannah. Alex wants to chat with Savannah. Sure, we'll chat with you. Our first and favorite son. Okay, so at least he can potty by himself now, so I'm just gonna have him potty a bunch because he's feeling a -okay. okay. Savannah's just so popular. People are constantly calling. Okay, so Lord Morgoth says, Hey, I heard you and Eric Webb are good friends now. Are you are getting more popular. Clearly, you are a good person to know. Okay, well, Eric Webb is our child, so I would hope that we were good friends. We're gonna have her sell that, and then you're gonna take care of Eric. You're gonna do shapes with Eric. And we're gonna make Eric potty again. Welcome. And then you can go to sleep. Or no, this isn't your bed. Your bed. Well, actually, you can plan your outfit and change your outfit, and then you can go to sleep. I don't know how she was bullied at school, but she didn't go to school. So that's interesting. But okay. Okay, well, then just stand here and wait for him to go. Get off the potty, okay? Oh, not the while he's finishing up. Okay, let's nice have like a little bit of a break. Ooh. Okay, let's get Christine all fixed up. Her eyebrows are very thick. Let's just give them a little shape. It looks like she has more straightish hair, so we'll go with that. That's really cute, but she has very big ears. Oh my goodness, her ears are huge. <laughs> okay. I don't remember who's her father. It's, I think it's Mortimer Goth. I think her dad is Mortimer Goth. I don't know. I don't think Savannah has really big ears, but maybe the Goths have like huge ears. Yeah, Savannah's ear is like normal. Her ear is it's very big. I really like that hair, but the way it's, it's working with her ear, I don't know if I can do it. Oh, she had- you know what? We can give her, like, some blue hair. Because she had blue hair when she was a kid. We can give that back to her. Yeah, we can do something like that. That's a little bit more subtle. Okay, we'll do that. Okay, so I gave you a little Christine makeover. I kind of went with the fact that her father is more bored off, and so I went for, like, a dark look. I think it looks really, really cute. We'll just get right back into the game. Okay, she looks... Terrible. So she's gonna go off to bed. Um, she's going to bed. She's doing pretty a okay. So you're gonna do your homework. And then Eric, how are you doing? Can you do blocks by yourself yet? No, you cannot. Um, how's your mother feeling? Your mother is supposed to be teaching you blocks, shapes, or whatever. So we have Eric doing his blocks. Little Danielle doing her homework, and then the other siblings are all sleeping. And it looks like her mom might just pass out any minute. And now the baby's crying. 
Okay, you just like randomly walked into our house, but that's okay, you know. Is I think this is Asa. I think that this is his child. So, I mean, that's one thing, but you didn't really do anything to help your child. Okay, what does it say? So, hey, what's up, Savannah? I noticed your name has been all over the, all the buzz lately. How do you feel about catching up? I mean, we were always friends before you made it big, right? Um, sure, but it's really rude to just pop on into someone's house, um, without knocking. Okay, that was awfully loud. We're just gonna back up from there a little bit. Okay, why are you awake? Why? I don't understand. Okay, you can eat something and then you need to go back to sleep. Alex? Hey sis! I'm really, really bored. Do you want to come over and hang out for a bit? Um, sorry, we're busy. Oh yes, we can finally- okay, you're- I wish he wasn't so tired because I would invite someone over. Okay, hurry up and sleep so we can invite someone over so you can drive your baby with someone. Please. Okay. After you finish eating, Alex, you need to do your shapes so you can age up. We do not want any more toddlers because little Frank is going to be aging up fairly soon. A costume party. No, we're not going to a costume party. Sorry. Maybe next time when everyone- I need to like get into a position where everyone's not like hor feeling horrible. And then I would consider going out. But until then, we cannot leave our house. And she needs to work on her skills. Um, so I guess maybe we can have her keep on talking to you. This guy, Asa. Just talk his ear off. It's a man that you should invite over this guy. And we can have a, another time. Okay, yes, your life is so terrible. You're gonna nap until he comes over. Um... I don't know why you're awake, but okay. Um, we can work on your skill. Cook something else. How about that? I don't know there's a whole conversation going on outside. Okay, you can go ahead and start cooking. And Savannah, you can wake up and do some flirtation. Please, can you actually flirt with this guy instead of... Okay, let me kiss and then I think we can just go ahead and okay, okay, come in. do a little bit more flirting, we'll pick up a line, all that jazz. Go in, yeah, the boy. Recite love Shaving poetry, Ponsa. sure. Okay, I love how like, um, little Danielle just decided to come outside and witness this, but we're gonna like let her go back inside. And you can... Take care of that baby. Oh, oh, this okay. Ponsa. You guys try for baby Garage now. Oh, yes, we can. Let's go. Oh, okay, why are you crying, Eric? Go back to bed. Go back to bed. And then you go back to bed. And then you can watch a movie. Go, go sleep. Okay. Man, I'm very exhausted, but we're gonna take a pregnancy test anyways. Okay, take a pregnancy test after you pass out. Sure. Please be pregnant since he's leaving. Yes! Thank goodness. Okay, we have to wait two whole days, but at least she's pregnant. This will probably be awkward to tell this right in front of your daughter. Oh, Okay, so she's gonna go off to bed. Okay, so I think I'm gonna end the video right here. We at least had one child age up, so like that's a good thing. And we are now pregnant with another baby. So we, we're still, it took us a little longer than I think it usually would take us. I feel like normally at the end of this episode we would probably have another baby. But you know, it's a-okay. Sometimes life throws wrenches at you. Especially, you know, we had to deal with death. We had to deal with multiple sims being on their periods and being very cranky and moody and all of the things. Um, we had to deal with a toddler that did not want to cooperate with us, so I think we did pretty good. So if you enjoyed this video, you can give this video a big old thumbs up, you can comment down below, and you can also subscribe to my channel. Thank you all for watching, guys. Bye!